everybody, it's Mike Merritt with Hoodale Tree Service. I just wanted to give a quick little piece of information about uh, the importance of roots on your tree. We're out here on a job uh, at a wonderful customer's house. Uh, honored to have them as customers. And I don't put this up to, uh, you know, be unkind to them. I just think uh, it, this will give a really solid uh, perspective on how important roots are to your tree. So we're taking this white pine here off of this spruce over here. So as you can see, maybe you can't see, there we go. We have uh, taken the top out. We got up in the spruce, climbed up to the tippy top of this white pine, rigged it down off of the fence. No, no worries there. But um, the reason this tree did this uh, is this customer is putting in a new fence. Beautiful fence, just trying to get uh, the backyard squared away. Uh, they've got an addition on the house that we took a, you know, a hundred plus foot white pine down because it was five feet from the back patio and uh, a very big liability to that new addition of their home. Well, they put the fence in, but they went ahead and removed some of the roots from this tree. And here's the remnant of that. And that is the reason why this tree uh, gave way. So if you you know if you're out trying to make your yard easier to mow or need to clear some room or you're gonna drive heavy equipment over a, a tree the area around a tree just you know think twice about it and make sure that it's not gonna um, hurt the tree so again I don't put this up to be unkind to the to this customer because I, I they're just great people and you know what you know and you don't know what you don't know. So if I didn't love trees and, and study them constantly and, and try to learn about them constantly, the most I would know about roots is watching my dad chop one up with an ax when I was like six years old. And I would probably think that that was okay because nothing happened from that. So, you know, you know what you know. So uh, I hope everyone's well in the, in the holiday season here. It's a beautiful day in Bloomington. Thank you for your attention and following us along. Wish you all the best.